everyone, welcome to the vlog. I'm hiding my face so you guys can't see the big reveal because <laughs> I want to show you guys everything before I show you. <laughs> Ready? And here I am. Hey guys, so I accidentally deleted the intro clip of this, so I'm gonna do a little voiceover moment. I basically looked like this. This is before. I talked about it on my Get Ready With Me, my last one I posted on my main channel there, but if you guys don't follow or didn't see that video, I am on my way to get under eye filler and um, cheek filler as well. And I'll show you guys all the before and after pictures. This is before the cheek and under eye filler. Okay, this is directly after. Oh my God, it looks so so good. My face is just like more contoured. So the next plan of action is these jowls right here. And I'll show you. It just looks like it sags here. You guys know that I had neck lipo, which my neck does look skinnier. I love how it looks, looks great. But right here still bothers me. This isn't my neck, right? Like this is my jaw and I have like jowls here. I really want to do something with this. We have a plan of action. Basically when I can, like when I'm like, cause I'm not fully healed from surgery yet. Like I can't get filler yet, but I'm going to double check with my surgeon always double check with your surgeon but she said my injector is inject yxe taylor love her basically she wants to put uh what is it tmj botox on my jowls right here and then it'll like tighten up the muscle see like it'll like but I won't look like that. I'm not gonna get a facelift or anything. But it'll just like pull back the muscle because it's like hanging. And then she's gonna put a little filler like here and here so that my jaw and like the bottom of my face just looks more like this instead of like, I don't like, I can't do anything about that. I am like losing weight going to the gym, but like there's only so much you can do with like, like the jowls that I have, right? Like, you know what I mean? So I think Botox is a good idea, just a little bit here and here, but I'm going to wait for my surgeon and every, I just have to wait for time to pass to, I'm going to go to the grocery store and I'm going to Giant Tiger because there is, I saw this, there's like stadium series hot dogs as soon as I say I'm eating healthy, but <laughs> To me, that's interesting. I'm like, what? Stadium Series Hot Dogs? I'm also using the mini bag that my brother got me. I'm getting so many compliments on it. I'm so happy with the cheek filler. That's my backup camera. It does that even though it works. Like, it works, but it beeps like that. I don't know. I think one of the sensors is gone. Like, you know when you go, oh yeah, right? When you go beep, 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 beep. I don't use that. I use my eyes and my vision. <laughs> I don't need that, so it's fine. I'm a little swollen right now, so I kind of look a little weird when I'm smiling. But And I did bruise a bit here, but I love it so much. Like, I just look filled out. I'm so happy. Okay, groceries. I'm on a mission. Oh my god, this is so cute. Oh my god, I can't wait to do my bedroom soon. Before summer, I'll have my bedroom done. I'm so excited. Okay, I think it's gonna be in this area if they have them. Um, Let's deep dive, everyone. I don't think they're gonna be frozen. Eyeballing everywhere. Come on. I feel like this is where they're gonna be, and it doesn't look like there is any. There's another giant tiger in the city, so I think I'm gonna go with my mom. But yeah, it looks like there is none. Uh, I'm gonna keep Okay. okay, these look amazing, so I'm getting them. For the air fryer, cranberry and brie bundles. Okay, Austin loves like things like this. Like there's cheese dippers, jalapeno poppers, and pizza dippers. I think pizza. He's gonna be so happy. Okay, so they didn't have them, but I found these that I've been looking for. These are also like new in Canada. Don't know if you guys have had these in the States or if they're new in the States or if they're old or if you're not getting them, but they're coffee. I know Coffee Crisp is Canadian. There's Coffee Crisp and Kit Kat Pops. So these are only like $1.80 each, so yeah. Finally found these, yay! And then I got some real bacon bits for our Caesar salad tonight because I'm making chicken parmesan. Okay, I just looked at my before and afters and my face is like, it, I look younger. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. 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 Wake up. 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 My under eyes were very sunken, and then yeah, I pretty much had no cheekbones. Like I've I've were very weak cheekbones. So I feel like my face is finally getting like evened out with filler and I'm very happy about it. I love being honest with you guys. I'm not like pressuring you guys, pressuring you guys or telling you guys to get filler or anything like that. I just like to share and be honest because I feel like that is like, it is important I feel in um, today's society, especially like, because there's no like image of perfect or like people think like, oh, like look at people online. I mean, I'm far from perfect, but um, people can see people online and be like, I want to look like that. Like she's so perfect. And it's like, sometimes it's like filler, which is fine. Or like Photoshop or, you know, Facetune or something, which is 
all fine, but I just like to be honest about it. I just can't wait till I can do makeup. I'm just gonna heal up and I'm so happy and it didn't hurt uh, um, at all. Like lips hurt way worse than this. And it's weird because I've heard people say that uh, cheek filler is like one of the worst. And I was like, it felt like relaxing. Like I didn't even need the stress ball or, ball or anything. It just, it sounded like crunching. Like I could like hear it go. It's kind of gross. It's kind of like when you hold in a sneeze and that like feeling. Like when I was in high school, I held in sneezes because I thought it, I don't even know, it's so stupid. <laughs> like stupid of my analogy of it. Like I didn't want to be loud or like whatever. Here's my little lunch today. I have some leftover roast chicken, some celery with peanut butter that I've been digging lately and a sweet potato with some butter. Oh, I should put some salt and pepper on it too. And then I have some hot sauce that I'm gonna use with the chicken, but yay. I just lit some candles. I'm running a bath and I'm going to use this. And I told you guys I would show you and I was gonna use it. This is the P. Louise bubble bath. It's like in a shape of a lip gloss. Let's see. I'm going to break, oh. <laughs> I'm gonna break this in half because I feel like it's too much for, oh my God. Oh. It's like sidewalk chalk, but I can get two baths out of these. Drop it. Okay, let's go. Ah! <laughs> Does she fall? Oh, she's a flounder. Pretty. Okay. Oh, it dropped. Okay. Well, maybe I should have added it all. <laughs> I turned off the lights, but. Ah! Okay, we'll just. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. We need the whole thing. She's right. P. Louise is right. Okay, I'm out. And either you could take this as it looks like I peed in the bath, or it's like a pretty <laughs> sunshiny yellow tangerine. I don't know. Hi, kitty. He's trying to, he's trying to entice Sophie. <laughs> She doesn't care, should she? She's like, what are you doing? <laughs> oh, never mind, I guess Sophie does care. She just comes and bites her in the neck, or bites him in the neck, what? <laughs> okay, so this is the chicken parm, they're huge. Uh, this is literally four chicken breasts, um, but I just pounded them like flat, and yeah, breaded them, they look so good. There's fresh moths, and then we made some sidekicks with it. Here's the Caesar salad. Here's our meal, here's Austin's, and here's mine. Okay, so I'm continuing this 24 hour transformation. Here's what I look like before I go to my appointment. Thank you very much. You too. I got my hairdresser, my friend, some Starbucks right now. Because she's gonna be doing so much on me. She's doing her lashes. She is trying to learn to do lashes. I don't know, I don't know what you call it. Like, she's apprenticing? I don't know what you call it. She's done a few sets and because I'm her friend um, and I had a hair appointment today, Turn she's right like- onto Confederation Drive. Okay, I will. She's like, do you wanna come in earlier and I can do your lashes? give you a full set to practice and I was like sure use the left two yeah, lanes to turn on to 22nd Street West thanks Siri or whatever the f is it Siri that gives me directions <laughs> If she's nervous or anything like that, or just to say thank you for like wanting me to, you know, be a guinea pig. I just wanna make her, you know, relaxed and good vibes. So I'm gonna be spending the whole day with her. So my appointment's at nine, it's like 8.30ish right now. And then lashes, and then my hair appointment's at one, and then hair is about an hour and a half, two hours. So it's pretty much the whole day. <laughs> so yeah, I'm on my way to like complete this transformation. Set up. I'm so excited. Here we go. Here are the lashes before and after. Ooh, like, bye. Now she's gonna slay this hair. We're calling her Slayla now instead of Shayla. Oh my god, I'm so excited. I had to pee in the middle of it. I never have to pee during a lash appointment. And my eyes are a little bit watering, but oh my god, she killed it. They literally oh. look like strip lashes. They look so, these are the best. It, lash extensions <laughs> ever that I've ever had. Oh my god. Before and and after. Cute look. I got my roots done. My lashes done. I feel like a million books. I feel like I look so cute. These lashes, they look like falsies. I love them so much. 600 and some dollars later, but I'm <laughs> got my roots done, hair done, everything done, or roots done, lashes done, everything done. I'm hungry now. It's like 3 p.m. I've been out this salon all day. It's nice outside too. Coop's loving it. Okay, so we made some homemade wings. We did some garlic parm uh, breaded or like just with flour on it. And then this 
is honey garlic with flour on it, breaded in the air fryer, all of this. And then these ones are like naked uh, lemon pepper. We just bought a frozen pizza. It was a buffalo mac and cheese one. It's a locally made one and it looks so freaking good. It's the pizza of the month. Like look at it, bacon mac and cheese. I wish you could guys could smell this. We added some sesame seeds on top of this and then some Parmesan and crushed black pepper on top. Okay, I'm meeting my mom. Uh, I like literally forgot to wipe off powder when I was baking. So I did it with the inside of my sweater. Oh my God, my face is a little numb still. So I'm like smiling like this still. It still hurts on my cheeks. My under eyes are don't hurt, but I have this with my lashes. Oh my God, my face is just a mess right now. So I'm meeting my mom on her lunch break and I'm returning some uh, Christmas things that she gave me baking. Here we are. Okay. That is what I'm dealing with right now. My eye feels swollen. Okay, so very important if you're getting anything done, any work done, even lash extensions, nails at all, if you do feel like something is off, contact the person who did it and get professional advice. So basically I contacted Shayla and I had a mild chemical burn and it went away within 24 hours. Not to worry guys, it is cleared up, but it is the dangers of even getting lash extensions and I like to be clear and concise of that. I have a headache, I don't know, I feel like I'm just like blah. Here's what I look like before and and after look at me <laughs> sometimes i'm high other times i'm barely breathing though i always gotta fight and hide from the demons yo negative thoughts are poison they ride uh. head full of flowers so here come the clouds uh. They'll never stop unless I can swap all the bad for the good in my head when I'm lost. Uh. Okay, so it's been 24 hours after everything. I put on this cute little white dress. I got my extensions in from Foxy Locks. You can use my code Foxy Sparkle if you want to save some money on Foxy Locks extensions because I love these so much. They're so soft. Love them. I did my brows. My cheek filler is settling nicely. It still hurts a bit, not gonna lie. The under eyes don't hurt, but the cheek filler, it does. It hurts. Especially when I smile like this. Oh, it hurts really bad like right here. So I feel like I'm talking funny. It'll keep settling, keep settling. That's another thing. Like everything that you get done to yourself, it's not just like smooth sailing. Like look at my eye. So basically I have a chemical burn. I've talked to my girl that did it and she was like, you have a chemical burn. I think it's because I went pee in the middle. Like I had to pee so bad because I drank so much water. I'm like leaning into you guys like I'm like a kindergarten teacher. <laughs> I'm like, dear ABCs. But I had to pee so bad and I couldn't hold it. It was like two and a half hours in. I was like squinting like this. So we think that maybe from like me opening my eyes, it just, I got a chemical burn. So we're gonna wait two to three days. It did have pus in it. It's not both eyes. It's just one. Uh, I don't know. So like pain is beauty. I'm still swollen. I have a bruise here. <laughs> People are gonna ask like how much was everything so the filler the two fillers it was uh like fourteen hundred dollars but that's for two different fillers that's one two syringes plus my under eyes one full syringe here one full syringe here i just like to be transparent if you guys don't like filler talk and stuff like that then just, i don't know don't watch this video the dress shein like probably four dollars <laughs> It's cute though, right? Like, look at this little dress moment. She's cute. I just wore it just for like the little after pictures and stuff like that. But um, I love it. It's adorable. I can't wait till summer comes. I'm leaning in like the kindergarten teacher again. Girl, the lash extensions were 220 for the full set. The hair was like 300 and yeah, that's about it. So like almost a $2,000 makeover in 24 hours. Is it worth it? No, I'm in pain and my eyes red. <laughs> But yes, it's gonna be worth it in the long run. I'm just like, I just like miserable. I just wanna like rip these lashes off and go to sleep. But I know that tomorrow I'm gonna be like, oh my God, I love my look. And on the weekend, I'm gonna be like, I don't have to wear lashes. And at the gym today, I looked at myself, I was like, oh my God, it's, I don't look like a naked mole rat. I have lashes. Like it's not a jump scare moment. Like I was like, oh, and I got a compliment walking in the gym today. The boost of confidence I needed. I was like, you wanna see my eye? Want pink eye? Want me to fart on your pillow? Like, <laughs> but I'm happy with everything. Thing. and I'm doing a food challenge today. Uh, my mouth is moving weird. I, I really hope that it's not anything to do with the fillers or anything. I don't know. I think it's just because this feels really hard when I'm like talking. So it's like, it's almost like it's numb. You know, like when your mouth is numb, if you've been to the dentist and then you like move your mouth weird after, I feel like that right now. Like, I feel like it's not my mouth. It's like my upper mouth. Like I can, 
Anyway, I hope my mouth doesn't move like a crackhead for the rest of my life, but if it does, oh well, I did it to myself. What do you do? <laughs> also, a little update on Cooper. Oh, he's just basking in the sun there. He is declining. He is comfortable. I'm in constant contact with the vet. He's on special vet food. He's on, you know, just he's he has the best care. He needs a haircut right now. Uh, I don't want to, like, uh, give him the stress of going to the haircut right now, but at the same time, I'm like, like, would it make him feel refreshed if I got the haircut? It's like kind of double-edged sword. I'm trying to keep him as comfortable as possible. Like, I don't want to, like, disrupt him, you know what I mean? Like, he's really losing his hearing. There's nothing you can do about that. His eyesight is not the same. He's really using his nose to smell around, but he's still, like, He's still eating, drinking, pooping, peeing just fine. He has energy. He greets me at the door every single time I leave and come home. He loves scratches still. He's still playing. He still runs around. So he's not like in bad shape, but he really is declining. He's just such an amazing sweet boy. I feel bad like yelling. I don't know if you guys have had dogs who are really old or who are going deaf or who are deaf. It's hard to communicate with them, especially if your whole life you're like, come on Cooper, like that. Um, I feel like he can hear a little bit, but like if there's like a uh, TV going or like the music going or if I'm watching TikToks and like Austin's like, okay, let's go outside. If he's, especially if he's sleeping, like he really doesn't hear it. Like we really got to clap. Um, he also, I've been asked if I have doggy stairs for him. Oh my God. I do. There are these right here. They're like little foam steps. I got these at PetSmart a while back. They do make it a lot easier. Like when he does use them, he just gets up right away. It is his first day off, finally! Yeah. We are going to the mall. They opened, what, like two minutes ago? I want the Super Mario Lush collection, if it's still available, because we're going to the movie tonight. We need a present for Austin's nephew, because it's his birthday tomorrow. What else do we need? There's something else. Zellers. Zellers. Zellers opened. Zellers was like when I was like a teenager and a kid and they closed their doors and they're open again, so we're gonna check it out. For the good in my head when I'm lost. Uh. Yeah, so I'ma fake it till I make it Positive thoughts are overtaken I got patience One day at a time is how you operate a cadence A flow, you grow, you show yourself a foundation Stay away from all the shit that causes temptation I know that I like to do it cause it's sensation I live my life in my head like a nigga. Our self-checkout today Oh, you're Please welcome your your Okay, I got this, the last one And I've been really Please wanting to try it Oh, you did great, girly <laughs> So I got my Lush stuff, I got that, we're good. Okay, so that NYX brow glue is like super trendy right now and I want it. I stopped fluffing up my brows, but since my eyes are always done now, I think I'm going to start fluffing up my brows to make my brow routine or my makeup routine really quick. So I got the last one. Guys, I accidentally left the camera sitting on a shelf in Winners. When we got back to the car, I was like, do you have the camera to Austin? He's like, no. I'm like, should I just put it in the bag? So he went, looked, gone. My heart shattered. We ran back inside. I left it on the makeup shelf. I never ever do that. Like so thankfully, we walked back to back in there and it was in there. Got a strawberry oat matcha for the first time and it's so good. Kitties, wake up. We've got a surprise. Oh, right here. We've got something for you. Wake up! Stinky boy! What do we get? We got something at Zeller's. Look at you guys. We're gonna be painting this room pink. Um, so this will go perfectly with it. Yeah, <laughs> it's a little cat bed and it's an ice cream truck. Look at it. It's so cute. It's gonna go perfectly with the theme of the room. And we're gonna put it here. So this is Coop's bed. It's been Coop's bed. But Cooper... You can go inside there. <laughs> Come on, get in there. <laughs> Get in there. It's comfy. I think they'll go in naturally. He loves it. <laughs> it says ice cream, and then on the back, or oh, I think it's the front, it says two scoops for me. Um, there's Look, Shugzy. Shugzy's in there. He's driving! Shugzy likes it. He's driving! <laughs> He's oh, looking hey. out the window! Shugzy. <laughs> He's driving! Oh, look at his face. <laughs> okay, so he never uses his bed. Honestly, that is the uh, <laughs> high stutter. So we're gonna replace this with that, um, or the other way around. And basically, the cats just sit here. Like if I'm having a bath, a shower, sometimes they'll just wake up and they'll wait for me to like get ready. They'll sit here. So it's basically their bed. Cooper always um, uses go here and sleep here, or he goes into Benny's bed um, right there with Benny, or he just like sits over here. So may as well up grade theirs and it'll be a cute little theme for when we paint. When are we gonna paint? Probably next month, I'm thinking. Next month? Yeah, just at the beginning of the month on my week off. Okay. So I'll start it and have at least three days free to do it. Okay. He wants a bag more than his ice cream car. Yeah, I want an ice cream car. Are you driving? <laughs> 
Steph's trying to get passenger in there. Oh, they're loving it. I just did some skincare. We are on the way to the Super Mario Brothers movie. I'm so excited. I really like cartoons and Disney. I know it's not Disney, but I don't really like cartoons. But Super Mario was my jam back in the day. I love Luigi. Like, I just am so excited. So today's a Super Mario day. He'll see Austin's hoodie when he comes back inside here. I'm so excited. We have tickets. We've literally had these tickets booked for like four days. Like, it's a concert or something like that. I went to Lush and I couldn't get all of the things I wanted. There's that like big mystery like uh, thing with a question mark on it. It's like a big like surprise mystery thing you put in your bath. They were all sold out. They were all sold out of Oh, all sold out of the Mario everything. They were sold out of everything peach. So um, I ordered it all online. And I've been having lots of bubble baths lately. Here's his hoodie. Yup, yup, yup. Show, show it hoodie. the back, show it the back. Oh my God. And then the sleeves. I gotta have the sleeve. And then this is the same. Oh no, it's a little different. It's a play on Mario. I'm but so excited. And we're gonna go there for supper. That's what we're eating for supper. Oh. We're just comfy cozy. I have a little light, I'm pretty sure, in here. So I'm trying to like be better at vlog and actually bringing my light so long. Yes, it's in here. It's fully charged. Let's go. Oh, we made it. Oh. Wake up early, gonna rise with the sun. Step two, get some good, some food in you. Step three, you grow hard about what you want to be. Step four. Okay, hey guys. So it is such a nice day out, or night out right now. We walked into the movie theater. It was raining, but it's so good right now. And it's just so nice to go for a little drive after. The movie was only an hour and a half long and it was so good. It, li it literally felt like it was a half an hour movie. It was yeah. so good. Like probably the best movie I've seen in a couple of years. Just absolutely amazing. The graphics, the acting, the jokes, the um, like Easter eggs in there, nostalgia, everything, the colors, it was so yeah. bright. And it wasn't like cheesy or anything. And they like combined different worlds like Donkey Kong. I was like, oh my God, the huts and stuff like that. We think that there's gonna be a second one just because there were some characters that we were like, where are they or where's this or something, but not in a bad way, but just like saying, like, ooh, maybe they're hinting at a, a part two, which I hope. I really, really enjoyed it. Just gonna go to Walmart too and grab a few things. My face is healing so well. I can finally like smile and not feel like so like plastic and like like hurt. It is hurting still, but I think that's why I had such a bad headache. If you follow me on Snapchat, I was saying I had a headache for three days straight. Well, I ended up having a headache for four days straight. And then this was day five. It's not as bad. It's kind of just a slight headache now. I'm healing nicely and we'll see what the rest of the night brings. Oh, <laughs> I thought I was gonna go right back up. 50% off Easter candy. Oh my God, look how cute this cup is. This little unicorn. These are amazing. Okay, cleaned my lashes, had a bath, moisturized, and now we're ready for bed. I'm gonna end up this vlog. I'm bringing back the joke book. So I am going to read you guys a joke right now. So what did the hat say to the hat rack? You stay here, I'll go on ahead. <laughs> Did you hear it? <laughs> the best. You stay here. I'll go on ahead. <laughs> Me. I had a great date night with my man. I got pulled pork nachos and he got coconut shrimp and we just shared. And I just got a bottle of water. I'm always drinking water. Got my ice water here right now. It's cool because I have little Happy Meal toys. I always get, ha whenever I get McDonald's, I get a Happy Meal. And I have these that I got Bowser here. I know I'm like a child, but they're just like by my bedside and they make me happy. And then I got Mario. Mario. Love it. I want the other ones, but I, for some reason, they only send me like plushies, like the same plushie every time, not of Mario. Like they're like little bears. I don't know. So maybe next time I'll just request the Super Mario toys if they're still doing it, which I think they should be if the movie just came out. But anyways, happy day, happy time. Um, I'm posting a lot of Snapchats, TikToks recently. So I'm on the social media game and I'm back and happy as ever. And I'm just in good spirits. And I love you guys so much. And you guys deserve content and up-to-date content and constant content hope you guys have a good day hope you enjoyed that joke and this vlog and i love you guys so much and remember to be yourself never lose your dinosaur and stay beautiful inside and out love you bye